Local dog lovers are taking their pups to a photographer who sees more than their best friend. Today in LA's Kelly Mack goes inside his studio. Sit. It is a glorious day in Malibu, and Frank Brimbreck is doing what he loves, taking photographs of dogs. Today, his subjects are Hootie, a three-year-old mixed breed rescued from an animal shelter, and a cautious, tremulous whippet named Runner. It's just about getting a feel for the dog right away and, uh, and waiting until I get that shot. Oh, that's handsome. Getting the shot is too humble a description for what Frank does. He just captures the dog's personality. You look into their eyes and you can only almost see their soul. Frank started taking photographs of dogs after one of his own pets died. And I was so heartbroken. I was just so devastated. I thought, I'll do a book. I'm just going to take photographs of dogs and, and do a book. Toward that end, he took pictures of all sorts of dogs, especially dogs rescued from animal shelters. And those photos are now included in a calendar. Part of the sale proceeds go to canine rescue organizations. So many dogs need, need to be rescued. I mean, they put down millions of dogs every year for no reason, just because somebody says, you know what, I'm, I'm tired of this little toy. Hootie's owner, Anna Reinstein, hopes Frank can capture her pet's impish nature and something else. It's almost as if he knows that he was rescued and almost appreciates it. Almost every day he just sort of thanks you for having given him a home. And with Runner... Runner's just very shy. She's very timid. You know, she's just a very peaceful dog. And I think he's, he's going to get that, isn't he? His photos are all black and white, generally close-ups. Some are humorous. Some are haunting. When a picture tells a story, I think they're just drawn to that. They just see the essence of the dog. Um, I'm trying to, uh, I mean, they look human. Frank needn't struggle for words. His photos communicate beautifully. For Today in LA, Kelly Mack, Channel 4 News.